My name is Annabelle Muller and I am shop foreman for the importance of being earnest. My name is Emma Davis. I am Cecily in the play The Importance of Being Earnest. My name is John Bordeaux and I'm playing Jack Worthing in The Importance of Being Earnest. Shop foreman, I'm basically in charge of everyone in the set crew. I build things well. I oversee what the set people are doing and like I help them with what we need to build and I give guidance and instruction along with the other set members to get our set built on time. This week we're entering into our tech stages, so we're going to start um, putting on costumes and uh, going through the whole show, running it from start to finish, um, cleaning up anything we need to clean up, make sure that we have all the props right, the sets uh, looking, on, um, looking in check. And then uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday we have our show. I've had rehearsal every single day for three hours since the beginning of September and we have rehearsal every single day until our show pretty much six days a week, um, some Saturdays also, which means I live here. I think that everyone should come support the theater department and see the importance of being earnest. Um, it's a pretty short show so it won't take much of your life. Um, it's a really funny story. Uh, old style British humor is definitely uh something, especially since it's by Oscar Wilde, that uh, people should look into and, and see for themselves uh, if they would like it. Describe the show in one word. <laughs> um, petty. <laughs> a lot. Deception. There we go. It's a, it's a lot. <laughs>
focus on the number, but do they really know their story? Today we take an insight look on one individual. Uh, my name is Reed Spockman. I'm number 44. Um, I play defensive end and I'm starting varsity this year. Well this year especially I've we've definitely become really close like I feel like everyone on this team I could see as a brother figure and it's just when you see walk down the hallway and you see one of like the other football players like you just smile and you know that that guy's got your back no matter what and I feel the same way on the football field, like I know that no matter what I'll do, that my teammates will have my back. To help out these individuals, come out and support them this Friday. Really the purpose of the Prairie is just to have a chance for kids to interact with something that's real. It's great to talk about how an ecosystem works, but if you don't get the chance to actually get out in an ecosystem and study it for real, then it really doesn't have as much meaning. We really want other teachers in every discipline to be out here doing like Shakespeare plays. Like why would you do it in your classroom when you could do it out on the prairie? We're just hoping this is another landscape that people can uh, teach a lesson in and make it exciting for kids. Uh, right now we just have one species of flower out here and uh, you can imagine if it's this pretty right now in three years there's going to be quite a few different species and they'll be blooming in every season which is going to be super fun. We have uh, students in our classes are going to be doing a lot of the work on it or just students in the environmental club are sort of spearheading the, the process of installing it. Uh, this year our goals are one to put out some signage so people, some interpretive signs, so people passing through can learn a little bit about the prairie and about the project. Who takes care of the prairie? Well, Mother Nature does. Mother Nature takes care of it. Once we get started, once it's actually established. Hey guys, it's Sharon Muller here representing the BVN Theater Department. Uh, as you know, our school is very proud of both the theater and the football team, seeing as the theater was invited to perform on the international thespian stage, the football team won state. So, we decided to see what it would be like if we took a theater kid like myself and introduced me to the world of football. This is BVN Football. Graham, throw me the rock. I'm here with DJ. Uh, he's gonna show me a couple drills uh, so I can whoop his ass uh, this time around on the field. All right. So that cone. To that cone. Uh huh. Back. Mm -hmm. All right. In under eight seconds. Under eight seconds. Yep. That seems like a long time. Six seconds then. Two. Three, two, one, go. Uh. Twelve point eight two. Nah. Nah. Oh my! F oh, one point one two. That's what I thought. Is that water cold? No. <laughs> All right, we just finished doing some runs. We're about to do an ice bath. Uh, so let me climb in here with my boy uh, Silly Bands. And Snappy, Snappy Bands. Thank you. We'll uh, we'll get we'll get this ice in. No, no, <laughs> Just don't no, move. No, no. I'm telling you, don't no, move. Your way. <laughs> Make sure you tell us when it's ten, because I can get like fucking <laughs> sick. That. This. <laughs> 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 
Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up. <laughs> no, bro. What the no, hell, bro? Chill. Bro, chill, chill, chill. Bro. Oh. Oh. <laughs> now, fill this one back up. I need to fill it. Don't move. Ah. It's actually pretty relaxing. That's right on my tongue. Ooh, ooh. Do you do this after every practice? Not every practice, but most practices. Why? You gotta eat it. I used to look like you. <laughs> you call me fat? No. You call me fat, no. Snappy? No. no. Damn! I feel like if I disperse the the cold. <sighs> you haven't peed, have you? No. People often pee when they take an ice bath in the ice bath. I pee in the ice bath. At Nick Detmer. How many more minutes? Ten minutes? Alright. That way. Bro, I just took a I just took a bath with a with a grown ass man. I just took a bath with another human. Is this what football's about? That concludes day one. <laughs> I'm gonna go take a nap. Hey there! Next week, Blue Valley North Broadcast will be giving away two tickets to the Ed Sheeran concert next Saturday. Make sure you go subscribe to BVM Broadcast on YouTube, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat for all of our latest updates on this contest and how you can enter to win. Hey! Hey you! You should go follow BVM Broadcast on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and YouTube. We'll be putting up lots of fun stuff for you to enjoy. Follow us or else.